Form.io offers the ability to easily implement OAuth authentication for user registration and login. This allows your users to seamlessly register and log into your application with just the click of a button. In this video, you will learn how to set up your project with OAuth authentication through supported providers. Currently, Form.io supports OAuth capabilities with GitHub, Facebook, Dropbox, Office 365, Google, Twitter, and LinkedIn. For this video, we will use GitHub as our OAuth provider. Before we get started, you will need to first have a login form tied to a user resource object with functioning authorization actions. More info on setting this up in the following link. Let's get started. Log in to GitHub and head over to the Developer Application Settings page. You will need to register a new application. Fill in the application name, homepage URL, and application description with any details you want to provide about your application. This information is displayed to users of your application when asked to grant permissions to your app. In order for OAuth to work properly, you must provide the hostname your application is served from. Input the authorization callback URL with the application's hostname. For this example, I'm simply pointing the callback URL to the Form.io platform. Register your application and take note of the client ID and secret. We're all done here. Head back to Form.io and open up your project settings. Click on the OAuth setting and open up the GitHub tab. Input the client ID and secret that we took note of earlier. Save your settings. Click on the Form tab and click the Edit button on the form you will be using for OAuth. Drag a button component from the basic component list. Users will utilize this button for OAuth login or registration. Give the button a label and set the action to OAuth. This tells the system the button will no longer submit but open up an OAuth authentication pop-up when clicked. We need to uncheck the Disable on Form Invalid box. This will cause the button to be clicked regardless if required fields have not been filled out. Since users will be logging in with OAuth, the email and password fields will be left blank. Form.io utilizes Bootstrap UI, which support numerous icon libraries you can implement on your button. Simply add the icon class and name to either the left or right side of your button. Once you're satisfied, save your component in Form. Now that we have our OAuth button, we need to add the OAuth action that will integrate with that button in order for OAuth to function. Click the Action tab on your form and select OAuth from the Action list. Click the Provider field and select GitHub. Since I only have GitHub configured in my project settings, that is the only available provider to select from at this time. You can add as many supported providers as needed. Click the Action field. Since we will be using this action on our login form, and the user already exists within our application, select Login Existing Resource from the list. Next, select the resource you are authenticating against. In this case, my user database is saved to the user resource, so we want to authenticate against the user resource. If you are using OAuth for registration, select Register New Resource, which will create a new record or data object based on the resource object you select in the resource field. New fields will populate with the registration option. The role field will allow you to assign a certain role when users register. Autofill will automatically retrieve data from the OAuth provider account the user is authenticating with, which can be mapped to fields within the form the action is created in. These fields will populate before the new resource is created. The last option, Link Current User, links an existing user that is not connected to the OAuth provider. For example, if a user registered an account without OAuth, 
but now wants to log in with OAuth, users have to link the existing account to do so. This option will allow you to perform this function. Finally, click the Assign with OAuth button and map the button we created earlier to this field. Save your action. To test the OAuth is working correctly, use the Launch page and click Single Page Form. Launch the form you wish to test. When your form is open, click your OAuth button. There you go! You now have a functioning OAuth authentication system in just five easy minutes. For more on OAuth, you can visit our help guide or contact our support team. Thanks for using Form.io.